puppy catters and welcome to our favorite cat products video. This is our third favorite cat products video that we've put out and I don't do one every year because they are so cumbersome but I do like to kind of redo them every time there are new products that I think are cool or whatever so here we are. Trig is really excited about it and Charlemagne is just being a good kitty. So in front of me and around me are some of the products that you're gonna see featured in this video, but there are a lot more than that. The reason I like to do these videos is because it really gives you a full spectrum idea of the cat products that are available that might be helpful. So if you're a first time cat owner, or if you've you know just lost a really elderly cat and are about to get a new cat and haven't had a new cat for like 20 years, you might not know about some of the newer products on the market that are really great to have. The reason I do these videos is for that, or if you are a longtime cat owner and are just looking for new, great cat products, um, hopefully this is a very comprehensive video. I also have a store on my site that just links to you know other websites where you can buy it, but that feature is, like, is basically like a, a Pinterest, if you will, of all the products that I really like, the cat products that are on the market that we've reviewed or that I know about or whatever that I know are good cat products so you don't have to spend a lot of time reading through reviews on Chewy or Amazon or wherever. So without further ado, let's get started. We're gonna start our favorite cat products video with cat toys. My favorite cat toy of all time is the Yao Catnip Banana. And the reason why is because it was gifted to my childhood cat Rags when he was 15 years old. He never played with toys for more than like two seconds. And this one he kept going back to over and over and over again. And I loved it because of that. And I reached out to the company. This was way before I had a cat blog and they were awesome to me. It's a company out of Minnesota and they use 100% organic catnip to stuff their yellow canvas colored shaped banana. And so if the cat's like busted open or whatever, it's totally safe for them to eat dried catnip. It actually helps their digestive system. So there's nothing to worry about. I don't like toys that have, you know, stuffing or fillers in it because you don't know if the cat busted open, if they'll ingest it, especially if there's catnip and like a synthetic fiber stuffing. It's just a recipe for a medical emergency. Also, every cat that we've had since then loves the Yow Catnip Banana. So that is why it's my number one, it's the best cat toy on the planet. The Ripple Rug makes our favorite cat products video because it is a great cat toy. As you can see, there's two pieces of rug. One has holes in it and that Velcros down to the bottom piece. And then what happens is it's kind of like a whack-a-mole situation where you can put toys or treats or string or whatever in the holes and then the cats can bat at them or like bust through the holes to get them. As you can see, Trig's flopping over here to attack various things. So I love how stimulating it is for cats and how much it encourages them to play. Both of my cats have loved it and many readers have reported that their cats love it too. So that's why it has made our favorite products list. Here's another new one that didn't make previous ones because we just reviewed this last year, the Black Hole Catch the Tail Cat Toy. This is very similar to a toy that was on the market years ago called the Undercover Mouse. It is a motor that has a wand attached to it that moves around in a circular or random pattern. And then it has that pink fabric on top that is kind of like an umbrella-like material. And so it makes this fun sound and fun movement for the cats to play with. My cats love the undercover mouse. However, as you just saw like Trig pull on it and the undercover mouse, the thing would pop off, the little wand thing would pop off making the toy then useless or me having to watch it or whatever. So I really like the improvements that Black Hole did to this toy. Their Catch the Tail also has this second option, which my cats weren't a fond of, weren't fans of, but I think kittens could go for that part where the 
it's you know moving around in a circle and just feathers so that's just a different wand option but i use this pretty pretty much exclusively as an undercover mouse type of toy and you don't want to leave it out unless you really know your cats it might be a supervised type toy but it's a great one to provoke play and exercise so that's why i love it well here's the classic cat toy that everybody probably has this is a bergen turbo scratcher cat toy which not all cats that I've known have liked this toy, but lots and lots have. And my cat, Charlie, who is hard to please unless we're going outside or doing something that involves dry food, really likes this toy and always has since he was a kitten. And it's great because obviously you can chase the ball around and all of that kind of stuff, but there's also a scratcher in the middle. So it helps them release emotion in a safe place that isn't gonna destroy carpet or furniture. So it's kind of a dual purpose toy and that's why I really like the Bergen Turbo Scratcher. Up next is the Nina Otteson Dog Brick. The one on the left, the brown and like beige one, that is the old version. And then the more colorful one on the right is the newer version. But basically it is a puzzle toy designed to help a cat or a dog, although it's called a, a dog brick. It is okay for cats to use it. You basically hide treats in those little compartments and then the cat or dog has to figure out how to access them, how to get to them. So it's a, a challenge. And what I like about this is you can put treats or dry food or freeze dried treats in those compartments. And if you're gonna leave for a few hours or if you go to work every day type of thing it's a great thing to put down for your cat to entertain himself or herself while you're gone at work charlie really really enjoys it i mean even when i pick the thing up to load it up with treats then it will make kind of like a plastic jiggle or whatever and he comes running for it i really love it for that and also that it challenges his indoor cat brain up next is the Rumpy Cat's Winged Bug Teaser. It is a cat wand toy that has a string attached to it, as a normal wand toy would, and then a little mylar bug. So there's a little bug that kind of looks like a fly or a locust or something like that, a cicada, if you're from the Midwest, and it has little wings. It could be like a little butterfly or something. And the cool thing about it being mylar is that it makes a fun crinkly noise, but also has fun colors that would be more like a bug would be in the wild. So the cats are really naturally attracted to it. I love cat wand toys because it really gives my cats great exercise and also because it helps them get that play hunt instinct out of them. And therefore, if we have a rainy day or it's cold, too cold outside or too hot outside, they still can get exercise that they need in order to want to eat later on. And Rumpy Cats just makes high quality cat wand toys. So that's why this one made my favorite products list. Next up is the Rumpy Cats adjustable wand toy, which is a little bit different than the Mylar one we just featured in the sense that it has different attachments. You can buy different string attachments to connect it to the main wand toy. So you, you can buy the main wand with an attachment, but then if you decide like this one, I think that is on there now that's in this footage here is the mouse. And then you can like buy the bug and different things to kind of like change it up if you're always playing with wand toys with your cats. And as you can see, my cats like this wand toy just as much as the previous one. It's just this, these have natural fur on them and then that makes it just a different type of toy. There's no mylar, you know, sounds or anything, but it has fun smells and fun, different fun textures that make the cats more interested in wanting to play with it. And I think cat wand toys are absolutely essential for an indoor cat's exercise and health and just having that inspiration to play, hunt, etc. It helps bring out that natural instinct in a cat and it allows them to release that emotion as well. That's why the cat wand toys from Rumpy Cats make our favorite products video. Moving on to scratchers and beds. The Perfer scratch pad or the Perfer long scratch pad are 
mid-century modern looking scratch pads that look very elegant in your home. You can see that I have one in our kitchen. This is the first one we were sent to review years ago. It still looks phenomenal. The cardboard insert looks phenomenal. And you can see it's just corrugated cardboard. But the actual thing itself also looks great. So it's not only a scratcher, but it also serves as a pad or a landing pad. And then this is the long one that Trig Smelling here in this video. So you can see the regular one is just shorter. The width or the depth isn't any different, but it's longer than the shorter one. And so you can just decide which one you know works for you. And you can see the style and the craftsmanship of this is not something you're gonna be able to buy at Walmart. And these are actually made in Poland and sold on Etsy and shipped to the United States. And he does an excellent job at shipping them. They come very quickly and they're very, very well packed. And then obviously the scratcher pad can act also be reversed. So you can get two uses out of each side, which makes it even better. However, you can also order a scratch pad plus a replacement one. So you're going to get one, two, three, four, because you can flip both of them four uses um, in one order if you choose to go that route. And it's just a great landing pad for your cats to scratch on or sit on, wait on, etc. These are the type of things that you want to have in your house to avoid your cats scratching on furniture and give them a place to land. My cats love to run to the smaller one um, or the bigger one, which is now my master. So that's Charlie and my master on it but the one in my kitchen, they run to when they're about to be fed or when I come home from running errands, they'll run and scratch on that and, you know, wait for whatever I've have for them or whatever I want to say. Cause I always greet my cats after I've washed my hands. So I never touch them until I wash my hands. So they're used to that. Anyway, because this is so good looking and because it's held up so well and it just a cool company with a good ethic behind it. That's why the Perfor scratch pad made my favorite products list. Next up on our favorite scratchers list is the Felix Catnip Tree Company Scratching Beam. This is one of those things that was like, why didn't I think of that? As you can see, it is a beam and what Charlie is standing on there is the beam. So it offers cats an opportunity to scratch above, below, on the side. It's great for cats that like to attack stairs and scratch them. My cats do both of those things. So I have really liked it for that. They also like it as a perch. And it's made of a sisal, or what's wrapped around the actual beam is a sisal-like material. So it offers a different scratching surface than the Perfer scratch pad that I just showed before this. And it will help you discover like what your cats are attracted to as well. Like if you're trying to figure out if they like cardboard or sisal or what, this offers a great option. But I really, really like it because it's a horizontal scratcher rather than a vertical one. So it made the favorite products video because my cats love it, number one. Number two, it's just a really smart idea and it's different than everything else that's out on the market that you can get just by going to Walmart or Target or something. And it's relatively good looking to have in your home. It's not a big eyesore. So for those reasons, the Felix Catnip Tree Scratching Beam made our favorites list. The Bowser's Pet Bed. Oh man, this pet bed. It is my favorite. Well, I mean, just look at it. Look at it. Isn't it, ain't it pretty? But beyond that, it is made in Canada and it is so well made. It's ridiculous. Yes, it's expensive, but it's also a bed that you can have the entirety of your cat's life. So, you know, if cats live 20 years and I spend $200 on a bed, then that's not bad, man. That's like $10 a year for a really high quality bed. All of the inserts pull out and you can wash the cover by itself and it's so well made, I can't stress that enough. It's also free of like toxic materials that you know they've used because they're Canadians and Canadians are good people and they do those kind of things. But also it comes in tons of different colors. There's so many fabric options that you can choose from and you have to have it, it has to be easy to wash. But okay, who cares about all of that, right? Well, I do. 
but my cats like it. Chiggy sleeps in this thing for hours and hours and hours a day. I actually have blankets that cover it because he's in there so much that I don't want to clean it that often. That's why this one makes the favorite products list. It is super high quality, super well put together, super easy to clean and even wash. And then Triggy loves it. So that's why it's in this video. All right, guys, you found a floppy catter's favorite. This is the Neko Ichi Cozy Cat Scratcher Bowl. And the reason it made our favorite products list is not only because my cats love it, as you can see, they've made quite a bit of damage to the concave corrugated cardboard insert that goes in the middle that is also reversible. But also, I can't tell you how many photos I have seen of readers' cats on this freaking thing. And my Aunt Jean, who has two ragdoll cats, has two of these. My cousin Mary, who has a domestic short hair, has one of these. Their cats, all three of them, love and adore them. My Aunt Nikki bought one for her ragdoll cat, Prince William, and he loves it. So it just, it's a good hit across the board. In fact, if a good friend of mine gets a new cat or a kitten or just I want to surprise them with something, I buy them one of these. I buy them a Yao Cat Nip Banana, and then I also buy them a litter lifter, which will be featured later on in this video, which is my favorite litter scoop. These are the three products that I easily gift to someone who's gotten a new cat because they're almost 100% a hit. Every time I've gifted the Neko Ichi Scratcher Bowl, it's been 100% a hit. Here's an oldie but goodie. This is the Pet Fusion Ultimate Cat Scratcher Lounge. As you can tell, it's a corrugated cardboard cat scratcher that's shaped as an infinity symbol or a number eight on its side. And Charlie. Charlie loves this thing. He's always scratching on it. He also likes to lounge on it. So it's a bed and a scratcher in one. And then also you can see with the holes that go through, if you have a couple of cats or a kid that likes to play with your cat or something, or if you want to play with your cat, like, uh, <laughs> like Charlie hit my hand there, then you can, you know, use it as a PlayStation as well. But the nice thing is you can also flip it over and use it on the reverse so it lasts even longer. And some readers have told me that once both sides have been used, they'll just cut it down the middle lengthwise. And then you have two brand new scratchers because the inside of the Pet Fusion Ultimate Cat Scratcher Lounge has not been used. So you can get basically four different uses out of it if you want. It's made of non-toxic material, uses non-toxic glue, so you can be safe that it, you know, be sure that it, it's safe for your cat. And you can't always guarantee that with everything that's on the market right now. So the non-toxic glue and stuff is so important to me because I see so many cat products that are just put out there cheaply so that they can sell a ton and they don't really care about what the cat's being exposed to. So the Pet Fusion one has been in our life for a long time. You've seen it in our other favorite products videos and it made this one because it continues to be a hit in our house. Well, here's another one. This one is the Scratchy Ramp 2.0. This is one that we just reviewed this past year. So that's what I mean. It's another new one that you haven't seen in our favorite cat products videos in the past. As you can see, it's an incline scratcher, which is different than the horizontal ones that I have spoken about in this video already, but it also has a replaceable scratcher now. When we got the first ones, it, they didn't have replaceable, replaceable scratchers, but now they do. And since it's an incline scratcher, you can move it to a different height to have a cat go up to a bed or a couch in this situation or a chair. And then you can also reduce it down and slide it underneath your couch if you don't want it out in the open. You could have it on the ground. If your cats don't like incline scratching, you can just have it on the ground and keep it that way without the incline. But I found that my cats really enjoy the incline. So if you're struggling to figure out what works for your cat, this isn't a great option. And Chiggy obviously likes to lay on it when it's not in the incline position. They loved it out of the box. Like it was hit from the very, very start and has been used every day since. That is why it made our favorite products list, but also because of all the other things that it offers with I had a cat that was in renal failure and had a hard time jumping up, not Camus, but my rags that I lost in 2009. 
and I would have killed for a product like this that was good looking that I could use later on with other cats and that helped Rags get up on my bed without him having to jump. So I really like two-in-one type products like the Scratchy Ram 2.0. Next up is cat bowls and food. I have a major crush on this product and have since the day that I saw it. This is the Panache Cubby Bowl, which is a glass pet bowl, and it comes beautifully wrapped. This is right after the unwrapping, and as you can see, it's a gorgeous blue, but they also have it in a tangerine and a celery, so in an orange and a green, but I like the aqua color shown here the most. It's made of recycled glass, and as you can see, it's just a work of art. It's made in the USA, it's very thick, and that's great and if you have a cat that likes to move around their food bowl or their water dish. I love to support a small company in the United States that is also doing things to help the environment by recycling. And my cats eat out of this bowl every single day. Trig is very prone to cat chin acne. So a glass bowl or a stainless steel bowl are the only things that are gonna prevent that from happening. Plastic and ceramic, if ceramic has a glaze on it and it has cracks in it, then the glaze can get bacteria in it. So that's why it's so important to use a glass or stainless steel bowl if you wanna prevent acne. Charlie has no problem with acne at all, so I don't have to worry about that with him. But I love, the panache bowls just make me happy every single day. And so many readers have written me and told me thank you for them. They are on the pricey side, but again, it's one of those products that you can have for the entirety of your cat's life. It comes with a great warranty. It also comes really professionally wrapped, so it's a great gift for a cat lover or someone who's about to get their first cat. It's it's just a great option, and many readers have loved the bowls over the years as well. Next up, another great option for a food bowl is Dr. Catsby's Cat Food Bowl. This one is their Whisker Relief Bowl, and that means that when a cat eats from it, their whiskers don't hit the side of it or whatever. There are some cats that have whisker fatigue where they don't like their whiskers hitting the side of a bowl and so they'll take the food out of the bowl and put it in on the floor to eat. So the whisker relief bowl helps that. And this one is really lightweight. It's hollow on the other side. And so it's very easy to pick up. My mom would like that it was lightweight. She wouldn't like the panache ones that are really, really heavy. So again, you just wanna know what your cat is like and you might not know if you're getting a kitten, for example, but this is a great option. You know, you could use like the panache for a water bowl and then you could use this one for a food bowl if your cat isn't the kind that like bats a bowl around. I also like stainless steel bowls because again, they're not plastic and they're not ceramic, two things that cause zits in cats. My Charlie has absolutely no problems with zits, but Trig is the worst cat I've ever had with zits. He gets them so bad that I really have to be conscious of what his chin touches and therefore I can only feed him out of a stainless steel bowl or a glass bowl so that he won't get cat zits. So that's why I like the Dr. Catsby's bowl. Next up are the Diamond Pet Can Covers. These pet can covers are awesome. They're very similar to ones that I featured in previous favorite cat product videos. My mom discovered some that we I just brought over to her because I, I don't need cat food can covers because I don't use big cans. I use small cans and my cats eat the entire can when I feed them. But my parents' cats weren't always eating the full can. So mom would, you know, buy like a 5.5 ounce can and only use half of it. So she'd need a can cover. So I was sent some and brought them over to her. And like two or three weeks later, she's like, Jenny, I really like those can covers. So these silicone can covers are really nice because as you can see in this video, it fits on a number of different size cans. And as we all know, cat cans can come in all different shapes and sizes. So it's nice to have something that fits on all of them, but also will fit on other products in your house. And then it's got that little tab on the side so that it's easy to peel off when you need access to it. You can easily throw them into your dishwasher and it's great. I. They're my favorite can covers for sure. I just showed them to our vet 
brought some to her to try out and she was like, ooh, these are really, really nice. She put them on a can of food that she was taking to another cat and she's like, oh yes, I totally like these. And I was like, I know, I know they're great. Moving on to treats. These are whole life pet treats. Whole Life Pet is a company, I think they're in Massachusetts, but they're a US company and they operate in a human grade facility, which means that they have to like pass human grade quality stuff. So it's it's more than other cat food companies that sell freeze dried treats. They have a higher standard to pass because they're human grade. A ragdoll breeder told me about Whole Life Treats way, way back when. And my cats have loved them ever since I, I started giving them to them. And then uh, I introduced them to my parents' cats and my parents' dogs and then my sister's cats and my sister's dog. And all of them love whole life treats. Sometimes they might not like, like the chicken, but they'll like the turkey or they like the beef and not the salmon or vice versa. Like you might have to figure out what that is, but they have sampler packs and you can figure it out that way. And I like also that they're one ingredient treats. These are, um, that you're seeing in the video are real foodie treats, but they also have just one ingredient treats, which is literally just the muscle or the filet of fish. And there's nothing else added. So it's like the purest protein that your cat can get, which makes me feel good about giving it to them. They also are now introducing things like probiotics in their treats. I really like them as a company and what they stand behind, but also my cats freaking love them. I mean, if you've been following us for any amount of time, then you know that they're Charlie's favorite cheats. Instead of calling them treats, I call them cheats. And so when we come inside every day, I'm like, okay, you ready for some cheats? And he starts meowing. So there's lots of videos on YouTube of him meowing for his cheats. And many readers also have reported that their cats love whole life as well. So that's why they made our favorite products video. I now actually rehydrate our whole life treats for Charlie and Trig because I'm concerned about kidney disease as they age and I want them to have the moisture that they can get from eating protein that has moisture in it. So I actually just add some water to their treat bowl, put the treats in and then wait one or two minutes and serve it to them. It took them a little bit to be like, what's this new texture? But now they eat them without a problem and I feel better that they're getting a, a moisture rich treat rather than a dry one. And now for a new category in our favorite products video, cat health. Next up on our favorite products list are Adored Beast Apothecary products. Here's a small sampling of them. The reason that these are making my favorite products list is because this Canadian company that was founded by a holistic homeopathic veterinarian really helps tackle common cat and dog, I think in horse problems, naturally, effectively, and calmly. So this summer I had a lot of problems with my cat Charlie with allergies and also he has a feline hyperesthesia syndrome and I had tried everything until I tried feline gut soothe from Adored Beast, nothing was working. And so feline gut soothe has really, really changed him around and made him back into a regular cat. And that has completely made me dive into Adored Beast and really want to learn more about their products and how they work and why they work. So we also have uh, Love Bugs, Healthy Gut, and Liver Tonic. And I might be starting Charlie on their leaky gut protocol here pretty soon. Adored Beast is also very, very, very particular about where they source their ingredients and what goes into their products. They really care about the animals. They cared about your adored beast. And that's why they make my favorite products list. Next up on our favorite products video is the Photonic Health Multilight. This multi-light provides red, green, and blue light therapy. And light therapy is a way to help the body heal itself. So it helps cells that are damaged repair themselves more quickly. What happens is a light therapy penetrates your pet's skin, blood, muscle, and bone using specific wavelengths of photons. Photoreceptors in your animal's cells absorb that light energy, which enhances the healing process by giving cells a boost of energy. 
Red light specifically is efficiently absorbed by tissue rich in hemoglobin and is beneficial for healing surface wounds and stimulating acupressure points. The reason I chose the Photonic Health Multilight for our favorite products video is because it has helped Charlie immensely, but also because it has three different light therapies, the red, blue, and the green that allow you to use the different modalities at home. And the Photonic Health Light in particular provides a number of videos, books, and customer support, which make it really easy to succeed with this product at home. So that's why the Photonic Health Multilight makes our favorite products video. Cat grooming tools. The Safari Cat Shedding Comb is an essential product in our house. I use it daily to brush Charlie's mane, especially in the winter. Not as necessarily in the summer, but Charlie is definitely a cat that ends up having a very winterized coat, if you will. He gets super puffy in the winter and then slims down coat-wise in the summer. So as you can see, this comb has varied teeth in it. So there's teeth that are shorter and teeth that are longer that help get in there. And Charlie and Trig absolutely freaking hate being groomed. And Charlie stands this comb. I don't know why, what it is about it, but he will allow me to brush his neck and his head and his mane, not on his body, oh, don't you try, but he'll let me comb kind of the necessary areas that kind of get gross with the safari comb and I really like it and I use it daily. It's an essential item that is a staple in my kitchen. So I have it kind of in my like loose drawer where you keep everything that you can't you don't know what to do with. I have it in that drawer so that I can pull it out easily when Charlie's meowing for food in the morning or, I don't know, hanging out with me in the kitchen and I see a clump of something or anything on his mane, I will go grab the safari comb and use it on him and I love it. So it's in our favorite products video. Speaking of my cats not liking to be groomed, the Equi Groomer is one of the brushes or combs that they will stand. So the Equi Groomer was first developed as a horse product but then was found that they it works well on cats and dogs. In this video, you can see that I am grooming my cats with it. And what happened, it's kind of like a saw blade and then it has little bends in it. And so it collects the cat hair like that. And Trig and Charlie really, really hate to be groomed. I can't tell you how many um, times I've been hit and hissed and batted at um, grooming them, but this is one that they'll tolerate when we're outside. And I do kind of recommend that you do it outside because it can get kind of messy um, or do it in a controlled area where, you know, the hair isn't going to fly everywhere because it will fly everywhere, but it does come off really, really well. And both my parents' cats liked it. My parents' cats liked to be groomed though, so that was easy, <laughs> but my cats didn't. Ah, uh, the Zen Clipper. I love this thing. I mean, I really do. It might be up there with the yellow cat and a banana in my head. The Zen Clipper I discovered at Super Zoo, which is in 2015 actually, which is a huge pet trade show that is in Las Vegas. As you can see, it has a little um, circle design that you stick the cat's nail into and then cut off to trim your cat's nails. It is so easy and so quick. I love it. And it helps to avoid hitting the cat's quick, which is where the blood flow is in their nail bed. So you measure the cat's nail or like the, the size of the hole that you need for your cat's claws. And then you never have to worry about cutting their quick, which is a huge problem when you have other cat nail clippers. Many readers have loved them. I am so glad that we have them. I still have the pair that I have from 2015. It works on both of my cats. As I'm aging, I'm 41 as I'm recording this video, and as I'm aging, my eyes are changing and my magnification's changing, so I want a product that I can use with my cats as I age to quickly cut their claws and get the, you know, get the whole situation over with, because they don't want to be there and I don't want to be there, but we both need to have it done so, so that skin can be protected and etc. Many readers have also reported how much they love the Zen Clippers. They're so they're just so smooth in, in the way they cut. And you can also send them in for sharpening if they do get dull for some reason, which is another huge bonus. It's just a good quality product that 
is rare to find in the pet world, especially if you're shopping at like Walmart or Target or something. That's not where you're gonna find these high quality products that will probably last years and years and years with your cat. So that's why the Zen Clipper makes our favorite cat products video. Cat litter items. Here it is folks. I mentioned it earlier in the video. It's a litter lifter litter scoop. It is God's gift to cat litter. Literally. I love this scoop. My mom picked up one of these suckers back in the day before I had floppy cats and it was always my favorite one to use to scoop Rags' litter box, which sounds ridiculous, right? But look how fast the litter falls through the tines of that litter scoop. And the reason why is because they're triangular. So they're in a triangular pattern, which of course, if you really think about it, it just makes everything fall. There you can see the triangles a little bit closer up. It makes everything fall through except for the clumping cat litter. They also have a pellet scoop and I think a crystal scoop. I'm not really sure, but I just like the original one the best. It is my favorite litter scoop. And again, this is one of the products that if a friend of mine gets a new cat or I meet somebody that has cats and hasn't, you know, is looking for products or I just want to gift them with my favorite cat products. It's the Yao Cat and Banana, it's the Nekoichi Cat Scratcher, and it's a litter lifter. I freaking love this cat litter scoop. It will change your life. <laughs> and I'm laughing because readers have told me, you told me it would change my life. And I was like, this girl's nuts. But yes, it did. It's a life changer. And I'm like, yeah, I know, I know. So this one, guys, definitely favorite top, top three. No doubt about it. The Litter Genie Cat Litter Box is my favorite litter box because look at it. I mean, how cool is that? And it also has handles on the side with higher sides and it has a little scoopy thing, like a little pouring spout there. So if you need to empty the litter out, you just pick up both the handles and then pour it out or pour it in to the other one. Oh, I love it. I was sent a couple of these to review a few years ago. There is a Canadian version of this product called a Litter Locker Litter Box. It is literally the same freaking thing with a different brand name. So that's how I first discovered them and they've been a hit ever since. I love the high sides. The high sides keep litter scatter in. They keep, you know, like little paw litter that falls off their paws. It also is super easy to pour from one to the other. I love the handles. They're wonderful and many readers have liked them too. So that's why I, it made our favorite products video. With every good litter box, you need a good litter mat. This is the Black Hole Cat Litter Mat. It is our favorite cat litter mat. It is one of those where the litter falls in between the little holes, falls down, and then there's the top and the bottom, and in between is where the, the litter scatter will sit. So you can then open it up and pour it back into the litter boxes, which is like heavenly. But the reason why I like the black hole one so much is because they have a rounded surface. So the litter, there you can see the close up, it's rounded. The litter isn't going to sit on top. It's going to fall through those holes and they're super easy to clean. They're very lightweight. Charlie actually likes to use them too as scratchers and it's like a foamy material. So his, his claws will get like stuck in the, the foam and he likes the feeling of that. And that works out well. It, it doesn't destroy it. it. The mat still performs to what I want it to do. And it, it's pretty good about keeping the litter scatter in. So that's why I like the black hole. And you can see that they also come in different colors. Hopefully match your decor or just get the color to your liking. And I've liked the black hole cat litter mat for years. That's why it's made our favorite products video. My favorite cat litter is Dr. Elsie's Ultra Cat Litter, which is an unscented clay clumping litter that I have used for over 20 years. My cat Rags used it. My cats use it. My sister's cats use it. My parents' cats use it. Many readers' cats have used it and all love it. It works great in automatic litter boxes, but regular litter boxes as well. And the reason it works well in automatic litter boxes is because it's hard clumping. So the clumps stay together and then drop below in the waste drawer. Also, it has a finer grain, which makes it inviting for your kitty on their paws so that it doesn't hurt to get into the litter box. 
I love that it's unscented. I actually think scented litters should be taken off the market. I find them highly offensive and I would guess so does your cat. And it's hyperallergenic. So a cat like my rags, who was allergic to corn, couldn't deal with corn-based or wheat-based litters. So I love it for that as well and will continue to use it for years to come. Cat hair and odor removal tools. Lily brush be forever furless. You're not going to want to live without this sucker. Man, does every floppy catter love this sucker. I love it. It is so great for taking hair off of furniture. It also works on clothes, but not as well as another product I'm about to show you. But it is so great for removing cat hair from cat beds, furniture, like anything that's not clothing related. But it does work on clothes as well. And unlike a sticky roller, there's no replacements to buy. It's like you buy the brush and you're one and done. So you can see here how it's removing hair on various products and how easily it removes it. I love it because I can do it when I'm like on a conference call. Because if I sit in front of my computer on a conference call, then I'll start like responding to emails or whatever. So I have to walk around. And I love to, <laughs> to grab my Lily brush and just like go at it in my house. Um, to remove hair. I also love to use it right before I vacuum so that I'm getting the hair off and not, and then I can use the vacuum to get out dust and debris. That's why I like the Lily brush so much is because I don't have to buy a bunch of sticky replacements. And then also it works super incredibly well. And thirdly, so many fl floppy catters have reported that they just love their Lily brush and couldn't live without it. So here's my favorite pet hair remover, the OXO Good Grips Fur Lifter for clothing. And I use, I have got one of these in my kitchen and I have one in my master bath and I use it on my clothes every single day. It's super easy. You've probably seen something similar, but you brush it in the direction. There's an arrow on the fur lifter and you just, you know, brush it in the direction of that and then it will help lift fur off of fleece off of pants, off of whatever. And then you just put it back into the holder to get the hair that you've collected off. And then you just pop out the bottom to pull out all the hair that's been collected. So it's all like nice and concealed in that holder until you remove it. It just does a really, really nice job on a number of different fabrics. And a reader told me about it long ago. And these are the pants that I use it on. I pretty much wear those pants every day. So I use it all the time on those pants because, you know, white hair on black pants, it always going to show up. So no house is incomplete without a good pet hair removal tool. And that's why the OXO Good Grips Fur Lifter made our list as well as the Lily Brush. Fission, man, I've loved this thing forever. We were introduced to this product way early on in my cat blogging career, and it's incredible. It operates off of CO2, I think, is how it cleans. When I first started working with the company, they were small. It was like, you know, dealing with the original people that were working there, and then either it got bought out or something and they weren't as fun to work with anymore but the product is still incredible and does a great job for diarrhea cat vomit any other type stains lucky for me my cats have never peed outside the litter box chiggy had diarrhea one time and that's because i had moved the litter boxes to a new location and i hadn't shown him where they were so he ran downstairs to go diarrhea <laughs> couldn't go so I've used it on diarrhea and cat vomit and different varieties of cat vomit because, you know, I've had cat vomit from dry food, cat vomit from treats and cat vomit from wet cat food. And it has picked up everything that I've ever tried to get it out of. And I, I just love it. It also has a really clean, fresh smell. So if you're looking for a cat stain remover, I would definitely check out Fission it's really worked well in my house. Cat lover gifts. I've mentioned before in this video that there are three favorite products that I have. But if you're looking for something that's a little more personalized, you might like this photo blanket from Canvas Prints. 
This photo blanket is the softest thing I have ever felt and the it looks exactly like the photo that I sent in to use and it makes me so happy. Now, th this is Camus that is on the blanket and Camus is now passed and it's just gorgeous. It's gorgeous and you can put it like over a bed like I showed, but it's also super soft. It I've washed it probably 10 times. It's still the exact same as it was the day that it arrived. This is a really cool idea. It's 100% polyester. Um, it's a, a cool gift to give to somebody who really loves their cat. So that's why I've included it as a cat lover gift because you can display it too. So it's just, it's just a cool thing. And that's why it made our favorite products list. All right, guys, that wraps it up for our favorite cat products video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. And we will see you next time. Bye for now.